Hello, everyone. RBG Kingdom Kid here, back with some more Sandland. In the previous video, we went and got another um, Aquanium, but we it was in a race, and it was against the one guy I can't remember his name, uh, General Crusoe. Does everybody Crusoe. in have bots or something? Um, I seriously doubt that. Bots are expensive to buy and maintain. And yeah. And we did some side yeah. stuff too here and there. Normal uh, speaking of side stuff, I did take care of all of the uh um oh what are they called? The bounties that I had. I actually got a trophy when I had in some of them. It was for taking care of like Only ten of the them. Army and the rich. So, so yeah. Um yeah. Um we are now making our way to this facility so we can get that aquanium back because it's one of those things where we saved him so it's like but they technically won so yeah that's why we gave it to them and then he was like hey we're gonna store it here but won't be there for too long so it's kind of like he's working with us without working with us so yeah And it looks like we're kind of making our... I mean, we're kind of making our way over here-ish. Which, by the way, is there probably like another... You know, we're probably getting close to a radio tower. But it wouldn't surprise me if we end up being somewhere over here. Or... We end up here. You kept me waiting. Kept you waiting, hey, huh? Hey, Crowa. We came for the Aquanium. <laughs> Getting right to the point, I see. I actually kind of like him. That said, it's not like I can just hand this over to you for free. So how do we settle this? How about with that one-on-one -on -one match we never got to have? Sure thing. Want to have it here? Nah, somewhere else. Let's find a spot that gives me the edge. Surely the leader of the demons wouldn't mind such a small handicap. Actually, the leader of the demons is Lucy. Fine. I'll take you on anywhere. There's a place just west of here. A Rashia village. I'll be waiting for you right outside town. You'd better be ready, too. I want our duel to be legendary. Alrighty, where the... F okay, well, at least it's somewhat close to that area, so... Yeah, I'll qu well, I guess it all depends on how it ends, so... There's the radio tower. Okay. Yeah. 
Okay, here we go. Oh, double treasure chest. Fine, I guess I'll open that when I get done with this. Th we can repair it. We can repair it, no problem. It's not like we have a million pieces of other stuff that we need. Alrighty. Alright, just making sure. Yeah, for some reason, when I, like, you know, opened okay. up everything to make sure, yeah, you know, to get ready to start recording. Um. Oh, hey, there's a thing there and a thing there, but that's fine. Yeah. Um. Uh, you know what? I'm going to see if you have anything of note to buy. Yeah, kind of do. Yeah, I, I got a lot of money by doing those um, things. Thank you for coming. Um, but no, when I uh, was getting ready to record, you know, I was double checking to make sure everything was working. For some reason, my mic wasn't working. A in terms of like it wasn't getting captured, I don't know why. Sometimes it does that where, uh, like I don't see the levels right away. I'm like, what the fuck. And I tried all the things I did beforehand. I'm like, okay, well, then I just deleted the old one, and then put in like a, put it in again as a different source. You know, I mean, it works. So, right? I mean, I'm seeing the levels and everything, so I'm hoping this works. If not, you're just gonna enjoy the ambience. I mean, I will say the music is really nice. So, get to enjoy the ambience and get to hear them talk all the. Fucking time. Also, get them. Yeah, I'll be honest, sometimes the, um, sometimes during those, uh, um, those bounties, the, uh, the mech actually does help quite a bit. Oh yeah, I also got a level up during my bounty hunts. Uh, Beelzebub only his skills have I can't get any more of his skills um, unless they're like level twos or whatever. That's not the way to go. Well, I don't know why I went that way. <laughs> I think I only just went there so I could fight. That's the only reason. There we are. And I'm recording. Like a few parts ago where I thought I hit the record button, but it was, my OBS was stupid and be like, oh, you hit the record button, but you didn't actually hit the record button. And you're like, oh, fuck me. At least that was 
sort of fun. There's a radio tower, but it's all the way there. Seems like you gotta go that way too. Is there any kind of like a camp or something nearby here? Because I'd rather. Ah, well, there's one down there. Perfect. Let's go grab that one quickly. This is probably for sure the way to go to that, so. I just want to make sure that it counted. Oh god, <laughs> that was actually kind of cool. Oh, but I would have been a little bit mad. Yeah, I also explored a couple of uh, of uh, uh, ruins. Actually, I think I only explored one ruin, but still. Is that not just? No, I guess not. Stop. Finally. The perfect spot for our contest is up ahead. Follow me. So tell me, what are you demons? Uh, dunno. You wanna handle this one, thief? Let's see. Well, we've lived on this world long before humanity even existed. Think of us as your venerable ancestors. Wow. So you're like the original people of our world? That's rad. So, that's who Supreme Commander Bread and Muniel are fighting with. We want nothing to do with this annoying conflict they're forcing on us. You're not thinking of wiping us all out, are you? Hey, we're not monsters. Leave us out of your dumb wars. Supreme Commander Bread is always telling us that demons are the baddest of the bad. But I'm starting to think that can't be true. Exactly. Demons aren't the bad guys at all. I agree. They might have the purest hearts of anyone in this world. Oh, our hearts are pure, all right. Pure evil. Bielz, how about you shut your trap for a bit? General Croa, won't you lend us a hand? You've been thinking, haven't you? About which side is right and which is wrong? Did I get that automatically? You motherfucker. I'm not so sure about that. Right is relative, after all. One person's right is another person's wrong. You mean, after all this, you really still think Bread is in the right? You're... the princess, right? 
Under normal circumstances, I'd be at your command. But these times sure as hell aren't normal, and I answer only to Supreme Commander Brett. I owe him for taking us in when we had nothing to our name. And giving us a life in the army. So you're just going to turn a blind eye no matter what he does? Well, to me, honor is more important than being right. But... Let it go! He's already made up his mind! He could kick a puppy and I'd say, good job, sir, may I wipe your ass? Yeah. You're nothing like what I expected. So, so, race? What the fuck is this? Or is this the ballerina? I mean, your fucking ride, holy shit. Right here. Now then, let's get started. Yup, you guys just let me handle this. All right. Nah. Now, my little demon friend. Ready for Here round go. two? Landing that hit, though? Problem. Watch out! Here he comes! Meet him head on! Is that all? I can tell you're putting your heart and soul into this battle. <laughs> As if. I'm a heartless, soulless fiend, you know. Oh. Did I accidentally offend you? That's some nice speed you've got there. Yeesh, this fight. Coming at us 
From all directions! Look out! Evade him vertically! Fight up another gear, Beelzebub! I really didn't the want to do busted. that. I hate healing. I do hate the fact that these missiles don't like explode right away and the whole like oh yeah they got stick. Go, Jesus. Took a while. Thanked. That's my loss. Here. The Aquanium's yours. You sure about that? You will definitely be punished for handing it over, won't you? Yep. Discharged at the least. Back to being unemployed, I guess. So, what will you do now? Hmm... That's a good question. I could be special ops, a staff officer, maybe a servant like you. Who are you calling a servant?! That said, I think there's a princess who's awful short-handed on nights. <laughs> You'll lend us a hand? I'm borrowing yours, actually. Oh, are you gonna ask for it? That probably isn't how you're supposed to do it, but anyway, my blade's yours. I thought you were like gonna ask for the marriage or Would something you like that. Get over yourself. But why? You said that you owed bread. Didn't I also say honor's important to me? After you saved me back at Staranis Ruins, I owe you guys too. You'll join us? Nah, I got another idea in mind that I think will be more helpful to you. Here, take this. It's a private line between us. Oh, I was about to say, you'll be my inside man. When the time comes, I'll get in touch. Okay. Got it. I'm off. Treat the princess right while I'm gone, will ya? <laughs> We've gained a powerful ally. Yeah. I say don't expect too much out of him. 
Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me if Kyle Hubert is voicing um, Rao, because that kind of sounds like Rao the... here. That kind of sounds like uh, the narrator of Dragon Ball Z. It's like, find out next time in Dragon Ball Z. Uh-oh. What happened? We'll explain after you get here. Bread is about to make a move. He's going to put a lot of jam on that bread, and it's... Raspberry! No, raspberry's not that bad. No, did I actually... Okay, I did unlock that. I was like, did I unlock this thing? And I did. On the brink. Alright, well, before we go back to you, let's, um... I want to go see if I can get that botanist. Does everybody in Forest Land have bots or something? Is every I time we talk about that. something bots or something, it's always uh, repeated every five minutes? I really wish there was a way I could turn that off. Yeah. Normal people couldn't hope to afford them. Only the army and the rich. Way to go is over here then. Let's see, is there another radio? T well, there's one all the way up there. Where is that radio tower? I mean, it doesn't look like any of the other radio towers Wait, we've there's seen. There's a radio tower. In a place like this, you can see it from far away. Or I guess we can use it as a landmark. Yeah, that is a radio Good idea. tower. It's like, oh, it's literally right there behind me. These instances like that where I I wish that these things were not oh will explode after a certain amount of time after landing. We can use we can repair it. Ooh, don't have that many of that, but I mean, if I need that for every single one of these that are left, it's not that many that are left. Um, I still have the two left in Sandland. Okay. So I have one left in this area, which is a little up north. Um, I've got one left here, which is probably right about there-ish, or could somehow also be right there. And I got two, so that's two... Three, four, 
Why? So I only have five radio towers left. Hey, now for some hot intel on the area. Arsland soldiers are pretty tough. I bet they train on the assumption that war could break out at any moment. That mindset alone might explain the difference in strength between them and the Royal Army. I'm pretty sure there's a road. You don't have to engage every last enemy. Picking your battles to save energy when you can makes a huge difference. Fair enough. Don't want to be tired out for the fights we can't avoid if we want to stand a chance. Scorpy camp. Thank you for coming. Sup? Hey, lady, you shoe by any chance? Shoe. Oh my, now what would a demon want with me? If you're here to take me away, can I finish my research first? Huh? We came to ask about plants. You want to come to Spino with us? Spino, so that's where the afterlife lies. The afterlife? Are you off your rocker, lady? Looks like this isn't working. Ma'am, we're from a town called Spino in Sandland. We were hoping for advice on raising plants in the desert. Plants? In the desert? My, that sounds splendid! But while I would love to assist, I am afraid it will have to wait. Why's that? A young Junker has taken to asking me for money, you see. And since he visits so often, I've grown quite attached. I can't leave him until he's old enough to make it on his own. <laughs> Ma'am, are you sure he's not deceiving you? <laughs> Don't be silly. He's such a sweet young boy. Just saying he could be scammy. Never mind. Perhaps we should look into the matter ourselves. Do you know where that Junker is now, ma'am? Let's see. I believe he said he's often at Sajida camp.
Got it. Thanks. Sagit Ita Camp. Okay, where the fuck is that at? Perfect. Hey, I found us a place to camp. Really? Well, shall we hit pay? Are you the junker fleecing Miss Shu? What's this about all of a sudden? Answer the question. You know Shu and Kentar, right? Of course I do. Why wouldn't I know my own debtor? Debtor? What the heck's that? Someone who's in debt to you, obviously. Huh? But aren't you the debtor? You've got it backwards. I'm the lender. I lent Shu money to help her research ways to breed new flowers. So the reason you keep asking her for money is... To collect on interest, naturally. That's ridiculous. From what Shu said... <laughs> I mean, that lady's got nothing but plants on the brain. At best, she probably thinks of me as a particularly fussy one that needs a lot of resources to grow right. She said boy, so I'd say she considers you more like a son. God damn it. I just can't help going soft on that woman. I'd usually be a lot stricter. But when it comes to her... Sounds like you've grown attached to her, too. Why not just forgive her loan? Not even I can be that nice. I'm part of a group, you know. If I can't get her to pay up, someone else will make sure she does. All right, well, how anyway, much is it? That's the situation. So, you all want to pay up for her? To know the details. But it seems her debt's a burden to you, too. How much does she owe, exactly? About this much. At eh, that's point, not that much. I'm just gonna forget about trying to collect the interest. Not a bad deal, huh? I have enough. Ah, oh, fuck it, wow. I'll pit. You're a generous one. I was half kidding, you know. But thanks. This settles the debt for good. Could you tell Shu... Nah, forget it. Just let her know. Sure thing. Next time I stop by, I will bring up Zenny. Oh, is that Bandit Camp? Is that the s Jokers? There's Jokers here? I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense. Well, no, it doesn't. I was about to say, was that, is this the Ace of Spades? Headquarters? Nope, it's the Jokers. What a bunch of jokers. About oh, I junk there's something behind the about. house there. He sorted out his money issues. He says hi, by the way. My, is that so? I suppose that means he won't visit anymore. I'll miss his company. I wouldn't be too quick to write him off. <laughs> anyway, now you can come to Spino, right? Ah, yes. Turning a desert into a garden. Sounds exciting. <laughs> See you there. Here we go. Earnest love letters. Letters from um, behind a house in Kentar. There's only the name of the address, Caro, and the sender Bean on them, but no address. One of the older ones was already opened. A quick skim reveals it to be a passionate love letter. The most recent one has a stamp on it, indicating it had been returned by the mail carrier. Looks like they were sent back because they didn't know they didn't have addresses written on them. 
So the sender only knows the person's name. Sounds like unrequired love. Ro looks like he has something on his mind. Prince, can we try to deliver them? So I'm looking for a Karo or Bean. Karo or Bean. Oh, well, there's Bean. Hey. Oh, you're a demon now. I'm a messenger. I deliver his letters, yeah. Okay, well, you deliver the letters, so. Cairo. 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 There's honestly definitely one I. W well, you would think it probably can't be someone here then, because if he delivers letters, he would know where she is. <sighs> Something smells like treasure. I should point me in the direction of that nose of yours, unless this was it. land have bots or something I seriously doubt that bots are expensive to buy and maintain yeah normal people couldn't hope to afford them only the army and the rich oh, let's go back to Spino will do for now. It's way more rewarding growing plants for somewhere that's bare as can be. <sighs> no side content, but uh, at least we got a few trees here. And I don't think it's for anyone here. Um Welcome. Uh, you still only sell this, but three of them. Thank you. I don't know if I need three of them. Hey, Beelzebub. Buy something or leave me alone. Drop by any time. Um, okay. Well, I highly doubt the person's here, so. Alright, what's, what's up, Doc? Well, maybe that person's here. Wait, what's everyone doing here? It's like they didn't even hear you. TV has that kind of power. Ah. Longo? What up? Keep watching. Keep watching. At long last, King Jam has admitted the error of his ways. Oh, that don't sound right. Moreover, he has agreed to cede the throne to Muniel. Hmm, yeah, that don't sound suspicious at all. And this is the proof. How does it look? Ah! Bullshit! Certainly screams royal heirloom, doesn't it? When King Jam entrusted me with this treasure, I had no choice but to accede to his wishes! To his will that I replace him as a ruler of Forest Land and defend its people! Silence! It is for us! The people of Forest Land, that Muniel has assumed this heavy burden. From this day forth, 
We must accept Muniel as our one true sovereign. That's some bullshit. No wonder they took her necklace. Shall be held in the palace square immediately. <sighs> this isn't good. I hadn't considered they could use the necklace to confer legitimacy. Now they're stealing my father's position by force, just like they stole the necklace. If we don't counter their narrative, they win. Why not just use the radio tower like before? If we contact your news office, can they help us reach out to the people directly? Sadly, no. The media has been the army's lapdog for the last decade. Then let's crash the ceremony and speak to the cameras directly. But will the people even listen to a plea made through such violent methods? Once they see I'm alive, I'm sure they'll pay attention. I doubt they'll like hearing that you're half fiend. <laughs> Sorry, Princess. Hmm. <gasps> What happened, Chapon? It's not just a coronation! At the same time! They're gonna execute King Jam! Chapon! This is no time for jokes! Oh. I'm not joking! Rumors are spreading all over town! There's just no way. Surely not even bread would go that far. There's no point in speculating. Portos infiltrated the army. We'll ask him when he returns. Until then, we sit tight. Or we can ask our man on the inside. You mean they'll execute my father? Now, now, we don't know that for sure yet. Let's rest up while we wait for more information. I expect Muniel will invade Sandland as soon as he's been crowned. And if he can finally achieve Bread's goal of conquering Sandland, even those who disapproved of Bread's methods will side with him. That is the absolute worst case scenario for us. I didn't want to say this in front of Anne, but the loss of her necklace was a problem. It's allowed them to make it look like King Jam willingly gave up the throne. I don't know if the part about the execution is true. But there's no need to keep the king alive anymore. Father. Because I lost that necklace. Piels, what do I do? If something happens to father. Good work, Horto. So, is the rumor about the execution true? Yeah. The generals couldn't stop talking about it. They were clearly shaken. The executions are supposed to happen before the ceremony. Longo! Don't worry. It's time for the resistance to rescue King Jam. To rescue King yeah! Jam! Yeah, I hate to be a downer, but do we even have a strategy? Only one kind of plan works well with our numbers. It's back to diversion and infiltration. We'll use the secret entrance known only to the royal family to reach the palace square. And the diversion? With the king being held hostage, any drastic moves 
could put his life at risk. The diversion will come after the rescue to provide the infiltration team with an escape route. Ah! Have you lost your minds? That's it. We're out of here. This is obviously a trap. Only a total moron would run right into it. I know, but we have no choice. Oh, well, be my guest. Just don't expect us to join in. Wait! Well, thanks. Fine, Anne. No point in trying to force him. But... Mr. Beelzebub is right. We don't want to make anyone take part against their will. Well, I guess I'll sit this one out, too. <laughs> no, you won't. Not on my watch. I knew it. <sighs> We've been fighting the good fight for an entire decade now. Let's show Bread just how much we've learned about guerrilla tactics over these past 10 years. Let's go. We'll work out the details in the field. Okay. On the brink. Also, the person for the love letters is not there. There's a capital lot. There it is. He's at the capital, so let's go hand those in quickly. Yeah, during those cutscenes, I was looking through. Uh, a list and I guess you do need to find them all and there's 58 of them that's a lot for a trophy um I found one that says like oh hey here here's here's where you find them all and then but they didn't like bother completing like where to take them I'm like what the fuck even though at the top of the thing they're like edit uh whatever date our whole list is complete now I was like no it's not well it's half right I'm an idiot. It's Forest Lands Capital. I don't know why I said Sandlands Capital. Eh, I guess we'll wait until the battle. Or I could just do it now. I mean, it makes sense that being. Oh, we can't even go into the capital. Okay, well, thank God they let me fast travel here at least. <laughs> Constantly going up and down all these hills really takes it out of you. I'm exhausted. Isn't it about time we took a break? Already? It's too soon to be getting tired. We can't keep up with you, Prince. <laughs> Sorry I'm late. Where's everyone else? They spread out near the capital to cause a diversion. I was hoping you'd assist as well. I don't mind, but what about rescuing King Jam? That's where I come in. You? On your own? That's crazy! Oh? 
I'll show oh. you just how wily this old fox can be. I think I know where you're gonna go. You're gonna go into that, like, yeah. You did always manage to evade me in your rebel army days. Huh, that's kind of impressive. Way to go, the old man. And Uniel are probably waiting at the palace plaza. We'll need more than speed if we want to save the king. Any human who could beat Lilith will surely be a match for the prince, too. I still don't buy that she actually lost. But if she did, thief's right. So I'm gonna go myself. Bielz! I want to see just how strong this Muniel is. Um, Bielz? Aren't we supposed to be rescuing my father? I know that. I'll rescue him along the way. Along the way? Then it's decided. I'll leave the infiltration to you. <sighs> Much appreciated. We can reach the plaza using a secret passage under that bridge. There's a secret passage? Then what are we waiting for? Let's go! Wait, was this always here or did this just pop up here? Motherfucker, if this was always here. <laughs> Don't know how I missed it. I don't think I got into the capital going through that straight way that way. I think I got through it a different way. You don't have to engage every last enemy. Ra, what are you doing here? Taking your battles to save energy when you can. Shut up. Oh, you're still with me. It's been ten years. Since I last came through here, I was so young, I barely remember the place. But I'm not using it to run away this time. Hang in there, Father. <sighs> huh? Is that it? We reached the end already? Shh. Seems there's still some time before the coronation starts. We wait here until it begins. Well, that's an interesting looking guillotine. Sounds like it's about to start. I'll give it a ray way, Rao. Maybe the fact that everyone's fucking wait. here. Scaffold? Never before has such a glorious day smiled I mean, I, I, I call it a guillotine, but... And yet, so too is it a day of mourning. Father! You guys wait here. I'm going in alone. That is a reckless idea even for you! We'll get caught if we all go. Just let me handle it. I just gotta sneak up to Anne's dad, grab him, and make a break for it, right? Be careful. If the guards see you, it's all over. I know that. Wait, am I actually, like, sneaking up there? King Jam was a good ruler. But it is a sad truth that it takes only a single drop of mud to befoul even the purest water. Tempted by a fiend, King Jam committed a grave crime. And even the king is not above the law. He must pay for his crimes. For prior to the coronation, we shall be holding the execution of King Jam. Not a chance! A uh, uh, demon? Take aim! Can you run, old man? We gotta split! Fire! <sighs> yeah, that's not him. This isn't what we agreed on. You promised you wouldn't really shoot? Uh, what's going on here? Beelz! That's not my father! 
It was a trap after all. Run! I knew something was off. Here you go. Something for you to remember me by. Why, you little demon? You grabbed the necklace. Thief grabbed the necklace. Let's finish what we started at End Mill Base. I won't waste my time fighting you filthy demons again. Uh, what in the world is going on here? It was all a ruse! We knew we might be walking into a trap, but not on this scale. Is that... the Forestland Army? The Resistance was supposed to distract them! Who, exactly? You mean this lot? I'm sorry. <laughs> we might be in just a little bit of trouble. Not so! Break for it! Don't let us in But for you, and you, and you! Prince, now! This is our chance to escape! to lose their heads get on your knees and grovel before me if i do will you promise to let them go unharmed <laughs> perhaps i'll consider letting them go what the hmm. heck i can't read this guy's mind either so what'll it be fiend better start begging before i run out of patience Together, Beelzebub! You aren't allowed to admit defeat to anyone other than us, the swimmers! The swimmers! It's you guys. Beelz! Hey! Yeah. After them! Do not let them escape! I'm just gonna run. Take that! 
That was nothing. That was nothing. So far, so good. You guys made it! Oh! Yes, thanks to you. Sorry to put you to the trouble. But why? I thought you wanted no part in this mission. Ha <laughs> ha! All just part of the plan. We always have to take precautions against Forest Land Army spies. So I had the swimmers make a show of falling out with us to take eyes off our assault team. <laughs> you pull the wool over the Royal Army's eyes with tricks like those time and time again. Well, they seldom worked on the great General Shiva. Surely you suspected something was up this time as well. The possibility did occur to me, and to the Prince, I think. Yeah, but I sure didn't expect it to be this. Yeah. That was insane. We almost died out there. It was awesome. <laughs> but it was a huge success in the end. Isn't that what matters? You called this a huge success? Oh, shit. My father turned out to be a fake. And all we managed to do was run away without getting hurt. What was the point of all that? Well, one good thing came out of it. I knew it! You got the necklace! Huh? Here. This is... my necklace! I know just how much it meant to you. I knew it. Gramps! S stop it! <laughs> that hurts! Stop it, you motherfucker! Very nice work, thief. Without definitive proof of the king's abdication, they might postpone the coronation. Way to go, thief! <sighs> Honestly, you lot. <laughs> It's a little too early to celebrate. Mr. Thief is right. We won't have resolved anything until King Jam is safe and sound. Sounds like it's planned, Jam. Oh, no. Contact Trick Camp and hurry along the preparations. I tried contacting them, but they're not answering. And the communicator's working fine. That's not good. That's strange. Let's head back. Yes, sir. That does sound odd. We'll come to the camp, too. Thanks. Well, then, we'll go on ahead. We'll visit Forestland Capital and have a look around for ourselves. Yay! I want to try coconut milk! Coconut milk! You can, son. As much as you want. Didn't I actually been on back down there? W wait, where the fuck am I? Here we go. Alright. Let's see. I feel, like, I feel like it's probably gonna be harder to find her unless she's like on the main strip. Not there. Let's check the main strip then.
Ah, there you are. Excuse me. Do you go by the name Kiaro? Kiaro? Yes. But who's asking? Helpful strangers who happen to have some letters addressed to you. Letters? Oh, they're from Bean! Wow, it's been ages! He must have had so much to say, it couldn't fit in one letter! <laughs> Actually, I think all the letters he sent over the years have been piling up. Ah, that would make sense. I left without telling anyone where I was going. Looking back now, I regret it. I wanted to change my life. So I moved to the city, but I don't know why I'm here anymore. Can't you go back? This person seems to deeply care for you. Oh, it's nothing romantic. He's a childhood friend. It's been years since you last met. Things might have changed. Well, maybe. Why are you so intent on playing matchmaker anyway? <laughs> Is that how you and your wife well, met? It brought back memories for me. Of what? I, I sent a love letter. N no, a fan letter at the time. To someone. Who would have guessed you're a romantic? It takes a lot of courage to write about your feelings. The more you care about someone, the more you fear rejection. I can't help but sympathize with Bean, if that's how he's feeling. I get it. Even if it hurts when things don't work out, it's better than never giving it a try in the first place. Yep. It's why I left my hometown, too. Something tells me you won't be going back to Kentar. No. Those letters and what you said reminded me of the dreams I was chasing when I came here. It's too early to give up on them. What about Bean? I'll write to him and ask him to come visit. I see. I'm sure he'll be happy to hear from you. I hope so. Oh, take this. As thanks for bringing the letters. Deluxe honey oil. Sweet. Um, wow, do I really have to, like... Do I really, like... I can't fast travel just to where we gotta go. I, I have to follow a path. That's gonna be fun. It's always fun following a path. Oh, this one might kill me. You stupid jerk. Right, let's, uh, I think we'll uh, maybe not. Uh, probably won't do this quest, but. Um. Thick vegetation makes for easy ambushes. That's certainly something to keep in mind when in the jungle. You guys make it sound like there's an enemy up every tree and in every bush. In Sandland, I thought there was one behind every rock or dune. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, we know we gotta go there, but it's like... Uh, it's kind of like the whole... You know, a few parts ago where we had to go to that one... To the one ship, but like, even though I've had access to it... I couldn't fast travel to it. It's more so like you have to follow the path. It's kind of similar to this in a way. Can I actually just go straight that way or actually can I? Okay, well now it's, I think I'll just keep following the path just so I'm on the path, you know? The forest land army is no joke, down to the lowest grunt. Out to the lowest grunt.
Their soldiers must undergo extensive training. Though I'd argue that for the most part, the Royal Army is just too complacent. You know, I will Constantly say it's going up and down oh all these hills. I was gonna say, really I'm, I'm glad that we finally got like you know some new talking points, but I'm we've exhausted. I'm pretty sure we've exhausted all of them in the, like the first five minutes of us Ready? being here. It's too soon to be getting tired. We can't keep up with you, Prince. <laughs> we can't keep up with you, Prince. Also, so like, I somewhat got it for the other. I somewhat understood it from, you know, the one with um, um, the battleship one. I understood that one because we technically shouldn't have been there before, but we've been to this one before. Like, like we've been here before. There's no reason for us to have to like. Follow a specific uh, path, you know. Just doesn't make that much sense to me. I mean, I know the reason why they probably don't want us to fast travel there is because they want us to see it like you know being under attack or something like that. I don't know, but you can't do it in a hovercraft. It'd break down before long, and you'd be stranded. I do a lot for you, but heading after you to fix it isn't on that list. <laughs> Maybe let's ditch that idea. Yeah, see, they wanted us to see this. <laughs> Surrender or face annihilation. Oh, yes. Hey, half dash. <laughs> If it isn't the fickle fat who is fumbling fiend himself. I'm a... What now? May you get hangnails on all your fingers and toes. Do you ever say anything that makes sense? Happy, <laughs> what are you doing here? That's all right. I can blink up my eyes, though. Is there anyone behaving so easy? Ah, why, sure enough. I spotted one such fool panically scuttling back to a tiny hole. All I had to do was follow it. Jack, what? I discovered the entire nest of rats. So, you follow Chapa. No. You're the only one left, Epi. Surrender before you dishonor yourself further. Mm. Surrender. I love how it's like. No, no. It I try to like this. try to summon a vehicle beforehand, but then it's like, no, you can't I'll do it. I'm like, fine. Then I summoned Rao, and that worked. And then it's like, oh hey. We have to catch them, or we're in big, big trouble. You got it. Okay, I somewhat, again, so before I say again, I understand why they had the path thing for us, but I feel like they could have just straight up let us go beforehand, you know? We're surrounded. An ambush. <laughs> I got you good, you foolish fools. Foolish fools, foolish fools, foolish fools, foolish fools. Fool. Let's make this the last time we have to suffer their stupidity. Suffer their stupidity. Look.
my beautiful strategy. Stratagem. That's enough already. Surrender. Why, you? I most certainly do not take orders from the likes of you. There is nothing I hate more in the entire world than being told what to do. Okay, don't surrender then. But as I'm feeling generous today, I will put up with it. Be grateful for my magnanimity. Uh, sure. For half an hour. Do you think this is another trap? I'm not sure. Doesn't matter. Our plan's the same either way. There's nowhere left for you to run, half stash. <laughs> How persistent chasing me this far. Oh, oh, persistent. Oh, great. <laughs> Another trap. Hey, he's making a break for it. No, no I think I'm. I'm just gonna jump off and kill myself. After I was so gracious as to let you off easy and retreat. Oh, shut up! And bring it so we can beat you down already! Oh, you impertinent little brat! As if a twerp like you could ever be a match for me! You think you can get away from me? Oh... Do you honestly believe you're a match for me? Ain't that! <sighs> Moving all over the place! Use your boost jump at the right time to get ahead of them! It's so annoying! You're becoming a real pain! Oh, don't move, you utter eyesore! Oh, I will patten you, lowly demon! Trying to catch a grasshopper! You're becoming a real pain! So annoying. It's so annoying! You're becoming a real pain! It's so annoying!
That was a close one, though. My machine almost kaputted. <laughs> Can't you be more gentle? Ow, 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 ow. Right down. Just sit there and shut up. No, quite the contrary. We need him to spill his guts. Blanco, how's the camp? Is everyone all right? We suffered only minor damage. Thanks to all of you stopping Epi. There's... Bag of EpiPens! Now then. Tell us everything you know about King Jam's whereabouts. And the Forestland Army's next move. Unless you want us to. P please don't be so hasty. You don't need me to tell you that. Explain. Hmm. The TV? Oops, I accidentally skipped something. In both the bright light of day and the long dark of night, I pledge to devote my entire being to... And do all in my power for this great nation of forest land and you hey its people. that necklace looks fake the oath has been taken from this moment forth we accept King Monio as our one true sovereign curse you bread so they went ahead with the coronation even after our attack No, I don't think so. Look at what's on Muniel's chest. It's my necklace. It could be a fake. I doubt it would be that hard for them to get their hands on a decent forgery. No, look at the square. You can't see any of the damage from Guppy's attack. Oh, so is it some like they recorded My guess this or would something? Be that they filmed all this beforehand. <laughs> and that's not all. What? As if that would work. For I am the protector of this country! Are you watching, dear citizens? Uh oh well. There has been a heinous attack on the coronation. The despicable resistance has joined with Sandland's royal army, allowing the fallen hero, Shiva, and his wicked demon allies to invade our realm. Well, that's All great. To prevent Moniel from ascending to the throne. Thankfully, we managed to foil their evil plot, but this affront will not go unpunished. Our brave soldiers and I managed to band together and drive those foul demons back. <laughs> but I'm afraid that many of our countrymen gave their lives in the battle. This was an unprovoked attack by Sandland! As your king, I cannot give them the chance to commit further atrocities! For the sake of those lives lost, for our great patriots, it is for them that I hereby declare war 
against Sandland! And it goes without saying, those resistance traitors will be brought to justice as well! God, he just has such a punchable face. What the heck? I hate to admit it, but it looks like we've been had. Oh, it's over! It's over! The Forest Land Army is nearing the border as we speak. What? We've got to let General Are know right now. But we can't contact him unless we go back to Sandland. Then what are we waiting for? What about your father? What? Well, you stay here in Forest Land. We'll go back. No, I'll go with you. There are people of Sandland I owe so much to. I won't let them get hurt. Oh, baby. I'm sure your father would say the same thing. We'll handle things here. Now go and defend Sandland. Okay. Okay. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, I leveled up. So I got two of them so I can either... Enhance the power of my square attacks, which I just might, or... I wait one more level. I'll just get this one right now. Hey, train results. Nice. Um... Might as well just get that one. Alrighty, guys. Uh, I think that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Sandland. In the next part, guys, we shall go to war. So, thank you all. So much for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give that like button a click. Oh, and there's a side quest. Ah, we'll do that one quickly. Give that like button a click and comment down below what you like about the video. Didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what you think of the coup. Well, not really a coup, but like the, the way that they played us for a fool. They played us like a fiddle. Let me know. And as always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to the main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter. Both of my main Twitter, RG, Kim Kid, Twitter are in there too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. Where's the side quest at? Oh, and I'll see you all next time.